Mr. Boss Peppy, you finally realized Hex is a scam? <laughs> <laughs> it only took him minus 99.8% to figure it out. Nah, 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 I'm joking, sir. Look, look, look. Um, You can go to gopulse.com, sir. Go to gopulse.com. And it's right here. <clears throat> go to gopulse.com. And you can actually look at the bubbles, bro. So if you go to one of the apps here, I think there's a bubble section here, friends. See here, coins, click on bubbles. But you don't have ticker selected. You click on liquidity, all right? So this just shows you the liquidity. The, that's the bid and the offer for each of the coins. Now, you're going, Hex is a scam. Okay, 17 million. Remember, 17 million is the bid and the offer, okay? You don't care about the bid because you want to be seeing how much does it take to push it up. So you remove the bid number from that. So now you're left with $8.5 million on the sell side, okay? So just think about this, bro. The, there is 170,000 Ethereum sitting there, bro. Okay, look, you know what? Even if you think Hex is a scam and there's zero demand in the world to ever join this community, okay, there's one guy that matters, though. He's got 170,000 ETH, man. 170,000 ETH. So to make that, to make this thing go up, 8.5 million, it's $8.5 million on the ask. Yeah, to make it do 100x, you have to insert uh, $85 million. Net, that's net buyer pressure. Okay, that's net. Remember, it's not like if he inserts 85 million, someone's going to swipe it down. Okay, but I'm just, just showing you like it's not. Look, here's the thing, man. If Hex went up 6x from here, everyone will be losing their minds. Okay, everyone will be excited. Just a 6x, bro. Like a 6x, man. You just need to insert like, you know, there's a couple of million dollars, like 10 million or something. It's not, not even that much. So well, I know, I know, I know what you want because it's the same thing what I want. We want to see this thing organically grow up with the rest of the market. We want to see that. Unfortunately, in crypto, we're so early, man, that we don't get that. I know, man. I want. Trust me, I want that every day. I want that every day. But that's stock market world stuff. That's because there's all these computer algorithms. They're all computing all the PEs. They all have DCA buyers coming in. So these people, they're looking for the tiniest pieces of edge, and everything correlates together. But in our world, we don't have that. We don't have all those people there. We're early. So we like die forever. And then when it's time to go, when Bitcoin and Ethereum reprice higher, everything shoots up like a slingshot. I know that that's pretty much it. It's, it is unfortunate. But then, but we also got to think about, think about like, like oh, for example, I know someone, divorced mom, got two daughters. All she can DCA is like 30 bucks a week. All right. And she's been doing it for like three years. And always thinking about her, right? I'm thinking about her. I'm like, man, crypto's actually giving her a chance to, to like do well. You know, me and you, uh, we're all in. We're like, bro, hurry up and go up. You know, we want that. But it's giving someone like that who could just put in $30 a week. Like, it's kind of cute. She's putting like, you know, six bucks here, five dollars here, four dollars here. It's actually amazing to see that. She's still doing it. It's been like three years because uh, she disappears every once in a while. Oh, my daughter just graduated and stuff. I'm like thinking about it. I'm like, man, that's some commitment. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's like we're, we're spending like three hundred dollars on gas fees sometimes. You see what I mean? So we lose sight of these, but it gives people like that an opportunity to get in. And I hate to say this, but they're worth more than us. Like, like they deserve it. Think about it. Like, like crypto is made to help them accelerate. You know, we're we're all in. So. But for someone like that, they can only afford 30 bucks a week. Cost of living is too high. So it actually lets them build a position over three years going down only. Now, me and you are here, but I'm here, like, literally, I'm here 18 hours a day. I'm like, oh my gosh, can we just go up, bro? Not even Ethereum can go up now. Are you serious? That's what I think every single day. But then I think about her. I'm thinking like, well, let's be honest, man. <laughs> if you had to design a system to be fair, you'd actually do it the way it is right now. You let everybody in. Let everybody in. People get wages at different times. People can only put in like $5 at a time. You let everyone in for a long time, and then you reprice higher. So that's unfortunately the real... It's unfortunate for me and you because we're, like, we're like, you know what? Fuck everyone. I want everyone to go up. I know we want everyone wants that, but that's the, the reality of the situation we're in. Now, you can add up all this liquidity, bro, and it doesn't take much to move, man, but... I'll just be, I'll be honest, man. Obviously, I, I'll tell you the truth about stuff. I'll be honest, man. If I was rich at heart, I would not be spending a single Ethereum in yet. You need Ethereum $7,000 plus. That's it. That's it. You do not rotate in before. You don't, man, because there's so many people who want to dump. 
You need them to get out. They are getting out, by the way, but you, you can't do anything right now. So, and by the way, bro, every person is critical of like Hex and all that. Don't think I don't go look at their coins. I go look at their coins. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's the same shit. It's literally the same shit. And like, and by the way, if Soylana is only up like 50% versus Bitcoin in the next 12 months, that's a failure. That's a failure. Why? Because you've you've foregone like 10x over here to make a 50% gain over here. And that's Soylana, man. That's one coin out of 500. There's 499 that are just dog shit. It's not easy, bro. I know it's not, it's not easy to deal with mentally, but you never know, man. Maybe this four-year cycle just comes, swoops it around. Maybe we do well.